Robert, the best YouTuber. Yeah! Woo! He makes the best videos. <laughs> and if you don't subscribe him, yeah, yeah. your holidays are gonna blow. <laughs> All of the other viewers, <laughs> they watch really bad channels. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Hello! People, welcome to the Robert IDK Christmas special. It's like if a Robert IDK video swallowed a reindeer. I hope you're having a wonderful holiday. Today, we're looking at Christmas gone wrong. Just basically all kinds of Christmas fails. If it's a fail, we got it. So, you know, grab your hup, your hup a cot hoco, <laughs> your cup of hot cocoa, you know, your warm beverage, uh, whatever, curl up and let's have an adventure, okay? Let's look at Christmas gone horribly wrong. And by the way, if you want to know what I want for Christmas, smash that subscribe button and that like button. That's what I want. It's all I ask for Christmas this year. <laughs> all right. I got a I got a <laughs> oh, a PlayStation. Awesome. <laughs> His owner was acting like a deranged psychopath. What was Ronnie supposed to do? <laughs> iPhone! iPhone 6 for me! Woo! What? Oh my god! Are you freaking kidding me? Good job, Sarah! Good job, Sarah! The gift I received, wrapped in such a way that it appears as if Linus and Patty are getting it on in front of Marcy. <laughs> really? Really wrapping paper? You couldn't have planned this? Maybe don't have the dude laying down next to the girl covering her eyes? I blame the wrapping paper company. This was supposed to be a wholesome Christmas! Disgusting. Disgusting. We do not stand for that on the Robert IDK channel. Merry Christmas, Bob. Oh no, the boys! <laughs> See, that is why you don't spray all of your presents with peanut butter scented spray. Should have known better. What is this gigantic mound of dog toys? Were these all for them? See, you spoil your dogs so much, of course they're gonna think everything's for them. Heck were you thinking? Grandma likes to get us puzzles for Christmas. She thought it was an elf. Mmm, elf it is not. Yoda it is. Mmm, right is that not Grogu? <coughs> Grogu very good. <coughs> elf I am not. The best Christmas retail fail so far that I have been sent. $4.99, cookies for Satan. <coughs> Yo, don't get, he does not need cookies. The last thing he needs is cookies. <laughs> cookies for Satan! No! No cookies for Satan! A message from your friendly neighborhood Santa. Anyone who gives cookies to Satan is on the naughty list for the next five years straight, just so you know. My wife and I have a tradition of picking up the ugliest tree at the tree farm. This year, we hit a grand slam. Wow, that thing looks horrid. It looks like someone burned the top half. Honestly though, I vibe with it. I vibe with this joke. You know, people aren't wasting trees. I mean, it's not like you're, it's not like an animal or something. I mean, it, it is just a, it's just a pine tree. It's already, you know, but I like the sentiment, you know, the tree that no one else is going to get, it would just get thrown away otherwise. You got a point from me, fam. You got a point from me. That's honestly a nice tradition. Poor tree doesn't get left out. I agree, demonic darkness. That's not a very holly jolly name, demonic darkness. Are you sure you're in the right place? When the Christmas card photo shoot with the sheep goes wrong. <laughs> oh, so relatable. I mean, we've all been here. This is what happened happens when you wear a dress made of corn. It's gonna happen <laughs> every time. When your parents wrap your presents last minute. Tips. Okay, again, this is the wrapping paper company's fault. You didn't, how did you, how did you, how did you, how did you not plan for this? What does it say? Oh, let it snow. Ah, it's supposed to say let it snow. Let it snow, let it snow. Tips. Very good. <laughs> wow. Every day we stray further from God. Tom's first Christmas. Oh, Tom! Look at Tom! He doesn't understand that the tree is not a gigantic scratching post. What an adorable little muffin. Oh my gosh, I love Tom. I love Tom. I hope Tom's doing okay out there. Oh, what an angel. Oh, what an angel. Oh, oh, this is the only time that Santa will approve of destruction of Christmas trees. Thank you, Santa, for the permission. I'm sure Tom really appreciates it. Interesting. I mean, 
I don't think this is the worst thing in the world. I mean, the man's wearing pants, though it does really look like he's, you know, doing his business, if you know what I'm saying. A really weird expression. Just don't give Santa this expression and it's like 10 times less weird. But yeah, a pretty tragic placement, honestly. <laughs> so that's how Christmas elves are made. Yeah, dude, r really? Really? Oh, oh, I do not approve of that joke. All right, homeboy on his hoverboard. Brand new. Thank you for the, oh no. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Christmas is canceled, people. How many clips of this are there? You know there's a million clips of dads getting a hoverboard on Christmas and doing a, literally exactly this. I guarantee one in 10 dads who get these things do exactly that. These parents got the wrong gift. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What is it? What's it supposed to be? Wow, what the heck? How do I feel about this? The kid doesn't exactly sound spoiled. The gift that they asked for was a, sp a different specific one. That's like if you ask for a Nintendo Wii for Christmas and your grandma accidentally picks up the Nintendo V, you know? You you ask for the Nintendo Wii, but your grandma doesn't know any better, so she gets you the Nintendo V. It's a real issue. That's why the Nintendo V exists. <laughs> The Nintendo V! This is real. This is a real thing, just so you know. They even did this fake animation! Look at these lies! Look at these lies! This was invented to trick people who don't understand! Loads of fun family entertainment. Loads of lies! Is what this is. Lies. You sit on a throne of lies. Man, that bothers me. How many grandparents do you think bought their kids the Nintendo V? <laughs> Thinking it was the Nintendo Wii. I am disgusted. Anyways, back to what I was saying. <laughs> I don't think this kid is exactly spoiled. They just didn't get the right thing. They didn't know. He didn't act like annoyed. Do you know a kid's spoiled if he acts like really ticked off? <laughs> <laughs> oh, and he does have some excitement. Okay, okay. It was, an, it was an honest mistake. The kid doesn't seem to be a spoiled brat. It's okay. Oh, no! They're a little too excited to open their present. This is literally the worst nightmare of everyone. This is the one reason why they tell you not to rip an envelope. By the way, do Americans say envelope? Or is that a Canadian thing as well? Envelope or envelope? Is that a... How do you- How did you- Anyways, this is an envelope to me. This, this is, is the, the one, one thing, thing we... <laughs> the, 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 the one thing, thing you didn't, didn't want, want to, to happen. happen. <laughs> oh, at least it's still kind of holding on. I don't know. The employee was happy to get a $50 gift card as a Christmas gift from his boss until he saw it was deducted from his paycheck. If this is real, this could be the most horrible thing I have ever seen. I don't know, I mean, he's trying to get on the naughty list. He's doing a very good job. Hey, don't say Santa didn't warn you, you know? The mom who only wanted to make her family a delicious treat for Christmas morning. This looks like the underside of a mutant squid tentacle. Got the suction cups right there. Sorry, let's move on. Uh, the classic, the classic wrapping paper! Tistmas Carol! Santa to Claus! Ain! Santa Santa to Claus? What? Snower! Rain, reindeer! Ain! Ain! This still haunts me at night during the Christmas season. What were they thinking? Tistmas Carol! What were they thinking? Absolute degenerates. Unbelievable, I'm so mad. <laughs> ah, when the dog, when the dog comes across the reindeer, bad things happen. That's why we don't have no dogs at the North Pole. Sorry, let me fact check this. Do we have dogs at North Pole? Uh, 
I, I mean, yes, of course we have dogs at the North Pole. Of course! I was, I was just kidding a minute ago. Wow. Reindeer. The reindeer are supposed to be singing. That ain't what it looks like. I mean, if I if I visualize this properly, it's very cute and I like it. I like the design. But if you, you know, if you look at it the way it... Come on. Either way, those are some rosy cheeks. <laughs> oh, stop it. Stop it. There's inappropriate Christmas jokes. I don't like it. The disappointment in my face after getting the same shirt I'm wearing for Christmas when I was 11. Oh my gosh, mom and dad, do you pay no attention to my, to my fits? You don't pay any attention to the fits. If Santa goes home for the family Christmas and Mrs. Claus gets him another one of these, she'll be on the naughty list. Brilliant idea. Horrible execution. It's the- it really is the thought that counts. So this is the- the Christmas movie made by the movie studio. And this is the wow. Robert IDK Christmas special. <laughs> that- this is us. <laughs> and you know what? I'm proud of it! I'm proud of it! This is the new Christmas tradition. Y'all thought Elf was good? Elf is really good, okay? I- I ain't trying to- I ain't trying to lie and say that- <laughs> This is even close. There are tons of horrible Christmas movies though, and I'm sure this video is better than at least one of them. I'm sure there's some Christmas movie that this is better than. My boyfriend said he made holiday cookies. Your boyfriend made holiday monstrosities is what he made. These are terrible. Might have to get him some cooking lessons for Christmas, dear. No pun intended. What the heck is- <laughs> You know what, I ain't trying to- I, I'm not even getting into this. I mean, on the plus side, I can tell that this is supposed to be Beast from Beauty and the Beast. So like, if I can tell what it is, then I'd say that's a win, you know? Again! Getting gifted the exact same shirt you're wearing! See guys, this is why you gotta buy your clothes online from, from random places. You gotta mix it up, you can't just go to the mall. For example, represent.com slash store slash robert.ek at one point was a great place to get clothes, but currently we aren't selling anything. But we will in the- we, but we will in the future, you know, stay tuned. He must have bought this when my merch store wasn't active. This is how well our Christmas card photo shoot is going. Uh, a little too much eggnog. Shame on you for getting behind the wheel. Be careful with the eggnog this holiday season. If you drink and drive, you are on the naughty list for life. And I'm completely serious. Merry Christmas to my wonderful brother and boyfriend. <laughs> what? What? Was this supposed to be a card? that you give as a joint thing to your brother and your boyfriend. It's like, hey, hey Bradley and James, I uh, I couldn't afford to get you guys each something for Christmas, so here's a card for both of you. Brother and boyfriend, sweet! Or is this card actually insinuating that your boyfriend is your brother? Or are they saying your boyfriend is like your brother? In which case, don't ever do that. Don't ever do that. Never say to your boyfriend, you're like a brother to me. And never say to your girlfriend, you're like a sister to me. That's like saying to your brother, you're like a boyfriend to me. It's a slippery slope, guys, no pun intended. What a ill thought out idea. What were they thinking? What were they thinking? As seen on Amazon, what actually arrived. Nah, nah, that's cap. That's cap. There's no way. See, this is why you gotta look at things with reviews, people. There's no way this had anything above a one-star review. You gonna buy a Christmas tree that doesn't have reviews? Idiot! Yeah, I don't know what you were doing, but like, all these Christmas trees have reviews. So unless you're telling me that people are satisfied with this, you did something wrong here. <laughs> all right, get in the tree. <laughs> and the tree won. Millie got run over by a Christmas tree. Oh, oh this is too much chaos. This is too much chaos happening too quickly. Leave the train alone, Sarah. What? <laughs> what a wind up. Oh my gosh, if that connected, if that connected, Candy would have flown across the Atlantic Ocean. Look at how much power. Look at how much power she had going into that. She she transferred her weight. She did the proper weight transfer. That was crazy. That was crazy. Power, excellent. Accuracy, bad. Oh. 
Th now you're just getting, now you're just getting greedy. You're seriously trying to put this tree up in your house? Are you kidding me? Who needs a tree like this? Who needs a tree like this? You people are crazy. You people are crazy. I'll give you the answer. No one needs a tree like this. That tree's better off supplying oxygen to, to people. Clearly, you guys are deprived of a little bit of oxygen in the brain. So you should have left the tree up and, you know, maybe it would... Whatever, I know. There's no point in reasoning with you people. What the heck? Yo, this, okay, this was, there were budget cuts this year. I'm very, I'm very, I'm very embarrassed that you guys are seeing this. You weren't supposed to see this. This was, uh, we had, uh, some budget cuts at the North Pole one year, and we just had to make do with what we had, and I'm very embarrassed that you guys saw that. No. Not again. Timber! <laughs> The camera operator did not sound too shocked when it came down. She did not miss a beat. Timber! I don't think I've ever heard anyone care less about a tree falling on their loved one. I don't think I've ever heard anyone care less. Does, does this not matter to you? Timber! It's like she planned it. Do you not care? You don't care? Oh no, it's the Christmas. It's the reindeer. It's Santa's reindeer. Don't look at it, Timmy. Don't look at it, Timmy. Now that's not nice. My people, I hope you have a wonderful holiday. I hope you enjoyed this video. From me and mine to you and yours, I hope you have a great holiday season, whatever you celebrate, if you celebrate or not. I hope you spend some time with people that you care about. And I hope that this new year brings optimism and good spirits and good health to you and yours. The support I received from you guys this year is definitely what I'm most grateful for this whole year. It really is the, the greatest gift I could ask for for Christmas and there's nothing more that I really desire. So thank you. Anyways, you guys, here's another Holly Jolly video. It's probably not Christmas related. This probably isn't either. I, this is my first Christmas special, okay? What am I supposed to do? Anyways, guys, I love y'all. Have a great day, have a great tomorrow, and have a great forever. Peace!